All right, this is a 1989 25-foot Lindy Class C motorhome, and it's uh, on a Ford chassis. It's got 47,000 miles on it, and we just got this out of storage. It's been in storage for about uh, probably four or five years, and so nothing's been tested on it other than uh, we got it started and we took it for a test drive. So overall, it test drove real nice, drove good. Uh, the tires seem like they have good tread, that they don't look dry rotted. And, um, but it's kind of rough, so let's go take a look at it. And, so you know what you're getting. Alright, got a little damage down there. Uh, I'd also like to note that the step seems like it was hit at one time. And a little damage in the back. Let's go down and take a look at the tires. So I'd say the tread is marginal, but they seem to drive all right. A little bit of rust on the chassis. And uh, yeah, the bumper's got a little bit of issues too. So this back corner has had a couple hits it looks like, light hits. And there is the generator. So we haven't tried to start this either. Um, the owner said everything worked when she last used the RV, but it's been a few years, so I'm sure it'll take a little bit of tinkering. underneath all right we're gonna step inside the RV and start up the engine just let you hear it uh, I would buy this RV myself based solely on the purple seat covers okay 47,000 miles And starts right up batteries good we put a new battery in it and um, but you can hear it's got a little bit of an exhaust leak uh, I did notice when we first started the coach up that it blew a little oil but I haven't seen it do that on startup yet since so uh, also this looks like a fuel injected engine, so that's a good sign. And the engine size is uh, a Ford 460. Okay, we're going to go inside the coach. And again, the RV is a little rough. But, the roof seems pretty good. Uh, doesn't seem to be sagging. And the RV doesn't seem like it's had much roof leaks. So, of course, got these awesome curtains and seat covers. And uh, just to clarify, we haven't tested anything in the coach. But... Still runs and drives, so you could uh, you could buy it and go camping right away. So, a couple awesome stickers here. Got a spare tire. That's the inside of the fridge. Uh, when I open the fridge, it does not smell like ammonia. That's a telltale sign that they're not working. So, 
I would suspect that the fridge does work. And I'm sure there's the shower. So with a little TLC, this probably could be a good RV. That was my phone. Oh, good luck. All right, we're in the 1989 Lindy, and we're gonna take it for a drive. Uh, one thing I noticed about this RV, it's got 47,000 miles on it, and when you put it in reverse and drive, reverse drive, like you're trying to check the U-joints and, and the slop in the drivetrain, it all seems real solid, no clunks or anything, so it's pretty nice. Um, all right, here we go. Got a little bit of an exhaust leak, as you can hear. Alright, I'm going up a hill and I'm giving it full throttle and we're going to just run it out. By the way, we got about a 15, 20 mile an hour headwind, so we're fighting the wind right now a little bit.